Hi, hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Infertile. Today, just see some interesting things about Wright brothers. Wilbur Wright and Orville Wright, who both were American inventors, who were born for Milton Wright and Susanna Catherine in Ohio, who have invented the first flying machine. During the childhood itself, they were interested in experimenting things and have a curiosity to know the things. Both Wilbur and Orville had an ability to innovate. They always pursued their intellectual interest and always experimenting about the thoughts. They both invented this innovative invention without their high school knowledge. They both soon became interested in gliders. They made their first experiment with a small kite. They established their own print shop and invented self-oiling bicycle. And after that, he, they learned how to construct and design a flying machine with the help of the past ideas. Their mother, Sarah, was very mechanically inclined. Her own father was a carriage maker and she spent a lot of time in his shop. She made her own appliances as well as toys for her children. The Wright brothers consulted their mother's advice regularly as they designed their own machines. Their life-changing moment was made on 1878 when Wilbur was 11 and Orwelly was just 7 years old. Their father gave them a helicopter-like toy. It was based on an invention by Alphonse Binot. You can think that who is Alphonse? He is a French pioneer of aviation design and engineer. They both impressed by this model. This was the inspiring moment for the Wright brothers to invent an aircraft model. For their invention, they lacked some money. So they started a newspaper printing business in 1889 and opened a bicycle repair shop in 1892 to collect some sort of money. They designed their own bicycle with custom features like an oil retaining wheel hub and coaster brakes. Things still used today in modern bikes. They also made gliders of increasing size which they tested over several years and flights. These glider planes put to test theories about wing wrapping. Later, by twisting the wings in different directions, they began to see how an aeroplane could be controlled. To make that increase size gliders, it cost around thousand dollars. In the Indian worth, approximate around seventy thousand. After inventing that, there is a small scabble between them. So they tossed a coin to see who would fly first. And the Wilbur won the toss. But guess first return failed. Orville went second and managed to fly for 12 seconds and 15 seconds for the third attempt and finally the flight was took around 1 minute. All those things was happened on December 17, 1903 and this day was the successful day for them. On May 25, 1910, the Wright brothers flew together once. They both piloted the planes individually. They took a 6 minute flight piloted by Orwelly with Wilbur as his passenger. On that same day, Orwelly took his 82 year old father Milton on a 7 minute flight. They flew at a height of about 350 feet. The interesting thing about them is they both never married till the end. And finally, Ohio and North Carolina of America was called as the birthplace of aviation. The plane which was flown first was found in the Museum of Washington. Later on, there is a vast development in the aviation industry.